Let's write some equivalent fractions for 2 6. That's 2 over 6. And basically what we're trying to do is to find a fraction that has the same value, but a different numerator and denominator. So if we multiplied 2 6 by 1, it'd still be 2 6. But instead of 1, let's do 2 over 2. 2 divided by 2, it's still 1. So we're not changing the value, just the numerator and denominator. 2 times 2 is 4. 2 times 6, that's 12. And now we have an equivalent fraction to 2 6. If you divide 2 by 6 or 4 by 12, you end up with 0 0.3. And that 3 just keeps repeating for both of these equivalent fractions. Let's do another one. How about 3 over 3? Again, 3 divided by 3 is 1. We're not changing the value. 3 times 2, though, that gives us 6. 3 times 6, that gives us 18. And that is an equivalent fraction to 2 6. The decimal, 0 0.3, and the 3 repeats. One more. How about 7 over 7? So again, we multiplied by 7 over 7, which is just 1. And we have the same value, 0 0.3, repeating. But we now have the different numerator and denominator. So this is another equivalent fraction for 2 6. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.